morning everyone, welcome back to another video. So this morning our favourite antique dealer dropped off some furniture that I bought over a month ago. And what I purchased was seven antique book display and storage cases from the most famous library in France, which is in Paris, which is the Bibliothèque Nationale Richelieu. And here is a photograph of them in situ in one of the many rooms within that huge library and museum. So, yeah, I don't know how we got hold of them, but we're very lucky to have that many of them. I think there was more, but they were all damaged or missing pieces. So I bought as many as I could that were complete. So I'm really happy with them. They're obviously gonna go in the library at some point and maybe a couple of them in the hallway so we can display our finds that we found while renovating the convent. Um, they've got lovely red felt inside. So yeah, they're really, really nice. They've got brass doors, which need a good clean, but they're absolutely fantastic. So what's happening at the moment is Yanis and Simon are at my grandparents because their house is a priority. We need to get them in their house and comfortable. So I'm gonna be here while they're gonna be there, but we're gonna see them most days because what I've got to do is, in the meantime, I've actually got quite an easy job, sort of, is the hallway, the stud work's done, the floor's exposed and the electrics are all ready. So all I've got to do is insulate and plasterboard the walls and the ceiling. So when Simon's back in a couple of weeks, we can plaster it and that hallway will be ready for its new doors, which I believe are coming February or March. So we better crack on. <music> So I've cleaned out the hallway, I've swept it, it's ready for work. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back home, change vehicle, go to Brico, get some insulation, enough to do the entire room, and then at the same time, we'll check on Simon and Yannis and see how they're getting on. So let's crack on.
I've been to Brico and I've bought seven packs of Rockwell insulation. I got the 75 millimeter thickness stuff, which is the same thickness as all the stud work in this hallway. So tomorrow morning, first things first, I'm gonna get the lift in here and we're gonna start putting it throughout the entire room. And I'm really, really looking forward to that because as soon as that's done, I can go and then buy a pack of plasterboard, 50 sheets, and then we can start knocking that up as well. So yeah. I'm really excited about this. It'd be nice to get it done. And then in a few weeks, hopefully if Simon finishes that house, um, we can start plastering it. So that's it for the convent today. Let's go to my grandparents, see how Simon and Yanis are getting on. You and Yanis are doing a fantastic job. Look at that coving. Yeah, thanks, mate. So, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. We're back at Billy's grandparents today, and me and Yanis are in the front room now, putting the coving up. Uh, takes a while because there's quite a lot of awkward little cuts because each where there's window, there's a bit of boxing that goes around the window, which hides the roller shutters. Yeah, I can see uh, that. It looks quite difficult. Yeah, so you've got a lot of cuts that go all around them, and there's three there, plus we've got the chimney breast. Yeah, to go around as That's well. That's a bit so, of a funny angle as well, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's work. I've test drive fitted a piece up there, and it's going to be fine. We've, yeah. got, we've worked out the angles and all that, so that won't be a problem. So yes, it's coming to the end of the day. I believe we'll probably get most of it done today. If not, there'll only be a little section left. Uh, so Yanis is getting the hang of it as well, putting the adhesive on the on the. Um, Coving, so he's doing well at that. Didn't take him long to pick that up. He's a pretty quick learner. Yeah, he's doing so, a good job. Yeah, so hopefully by, you know, maybe an hour in the morning, if nothing, we'll have this all done, finished, and then we can concentrate uh, laying the floor. All oh, right, okay, and doing the skirting as well. That'd be fantastic if you could start laying the floor because that would really change the room, wouldn't it? Yeah, I mean, there's yeah. a little bit of painting to do just around the bottom. Uh, your granddad's, he's been filling some, some of the uh, old. Cove uh, skirting marks when he took yeah. it off, it's put some holes in there. So he's been filling that. So by yeah. the morning, that'll be dry. It's lovely and warm in here. We've got the fire going. So we'll be able to sand that down tomorrow. Uh, and I can get Yanis to go around with the brush to bring the paint down. Yep. We can lay the underlay down for the flooring and then we can start putting the flooring down. Smash And in. I believe it's going to flow right through into the hallway as well. So it'll be one oh. continuous oh, right. bit of flooring going all the way through and then hopefully it'll meet up with the bedroom yep. as well. <laughs> <our fingers crossed. laughs> Brilliant. So, yeah, that's what we've been doing this afternoon. All right then, mate, I'll let you crack on a bit then. Okay, yep, we've only got a little while left. We want to try and get most of it done, so we'll crack on. So I've left Simon and Yanis to it because they're doing a fantastic job. They don't need my help whatsoever. Yanis has come a long way since he started working for us. He's very skilled now. He, know, he knows exactly what he's doing under the supervision of Simon, which is really good to see. So you probably noticed that I'm filming today's vlog. I'm filming all of the vlogs from now on. Alex is going to be back in about a month's time, maybe. We're going to miss Alex, but we've got a crack on. So yeah, I'm filming all of the vlogs. They won't be as long. They'll be a bit more like before, short daily videos. Um, so yeah, I'm excited for tomorrow. Can't wait to start insulating the hallway. I'll try and get that done as quick as possible and then we can start plasterboarding and then get the ceiling done, things like that. It's gonna be fantastic. So thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you all tomorrow.